New at five, when you think of first responders, you generally think of police, firefighters, or medical personnel, but not all heroes arrive in a truck with flashing lights and sirens. For the people at the Moorish Blessed Hands Food Pantry, the poverty crisis is an emergency for so many Detroiters. And our Ray Strickland introduces us to a man who has been fighting hunger in Detroit for more than 20 years now by giving out food every week to those who need it. Every Tuesday and Thursday, a group of people with the Moorish Blessed Hands Food Pantry gather on Detroit's west side. The pantry, powered by a mini infantry of volunteers with the sole purpose of feeding their community. The man leading their mission, Minister Fuque Bay of the Moorish Science Temple of America Number 25. Bay and his team providing what they call blessings in a bag for the community, bags full of essential food items, such as vegetables, fruit, and more. Well, we've been doing it for over 20 years. We got the corn. Bay there, describes himself beans. as a first responder on the front lines of the city's ongoing hunger crisis. It's a problem when people don't have enough to make it from paycheck to paycheck. Bay's food pantry is located on Wyoming and Puritan, an area made up of low-income residents. He says this part of the West Side community is a food desert. The issue of poverty brought to light even more so during the pandemic, where Bay says the need was more than anyone could have imagined. We were serving sometimes 2,500 meals a day. And he says he and his team gave away over 100,000 meals during COVID. I'm in there, Curry. Today, those going hungry, of course, are still in need. And when there is nowhere else to turn, the community comes to Bay's right, food pantry. Green. Cars lined up outside the building. Some waited over an hour to get their hands on much needed food. But much needed is just an understatement after listening to Mitty Frost. There are so many seniors on such a low income that they have to buy dog food to the regular food for people. Let me tell you. Thank God. Thank God for you. How much does this help you? This will help me a lot. This help me a lot. Thank you so much. Hi, how are you? I'm blessed. Stories like the one you just heard from Mitty are what give Bay and his team their why. And you would think feeding as many people as he has over the years, it would be a cause to celebrate. But it's not. And it's just another reason why Bay can't give up on his community. People say you be too humble sometimes and that I'm saying that it's a lot more that needs to be done. All right. Reporting on the city's west side, Ray Strickland, CBS News Detroit.